got to write with one of my other favorite guitar players besides Josh um, is a girl named Corey Cooper from Van Skillet. She's one of my favorite people for a lot of reasons. Um, and when I when I was writing this song, I had a loved one that had just passed away. Um, my aunt was in the ICU. She would flatline. They would bring her back. She would flatline. They would bring her back. And every time they brought her back, she would ask for one of her loved ones to come see her. And she wanted to tell them what I want to say tonight to you. That's why I'm telling this story. She wanted to tell them that when she was gone, that they weren't going to be alone. That was her message. And, you know, so often we put all this weight in someone to be God for us and they turn out to be human. And the thing is, it's too much weight for someone to carry to be God for you. It's too much weight for you to carry to be God for someone else. The only one who's God enough to be God for us is God himself. And what she wanted them to know is that it's actually real. And you are not alone. When I leave you, when everything fails you, you're not alone. When it seems like you're the most alone is when he's the closest to you. And so... This is what she wanted to say, and um, she got to say those things in her own ways to different people. And, and I think I want to say that to people here tonight who might feel like they're so alone. I know I felt that way before, and um, it sounds like such a simple thing. But if it gets stuck in your head, and it gets stuck in your head enough, then you can start to believe it and start to actually see that you're not alone. And this is what this song's called, You're Not Alone. Self-destructs, let truth hold you in loving arms tonight. 